Victory Fights presents three two-minute rounds of K1 kickboxing. Introducing first, in the blue corner, Hadi Khan! Across the cage, his opponent stands in the red corner, George Taylor! Charlotte Lawrence is in charge of the action. Let's get down to business. So here we go, K1 action. Hadi Khan versus George Taylor. Straight into it, Taylor with a big body kick. Taylor making all the use of that reach. Nice work with the legs there. George Taylor in the red corner coming out of the Ken Shiro gym. Nice defense by Taylor. Khan catches and fires back. Oh, big bombs there. Good work by Khan. Tries to work that work on closing that distance. Taylor is doing a great job with that reach, but Khan is showing he's here to fight. Big right hand. Does a good job of shutting down that, that range. Clash of legs. Lovely shot to the body. But Khan also doing a great job. He's dealing with the reach very, very well. He's countering the kicks with big hand shots. Oh, oh lovely big head kick. And one to the body. Taylor using, as you said, that reach to his advantage. Clearly working well with those legs. What I'm pleased with is how relaxed Taylor is. He's nice and relaxed. He's wearing the shots well. He's keeping his hands high. Oh, lovely head kick. Making Khan do all the work. Taylor really getting into his groove. He's got Khan backed up against the cage. It's a great first round for Taylor Khan. Fought well. Trying to work on the inside to overcome that reach advantage. Khan started off very strong in the beginning of the round and he seemed to fade off a little bit as the round went on. He seemed to get backed up against the cage a little bit. But I think Taylor doing a great job picking his shots. And what is most impressive that I'm seeing from him is composure. That's what I've been really impressed with tonight, with a lot of these debutantes, with a lot of these first timers, these young fighters. Just seeing the composure that they're showing is fantastic for me. Taylor walking his man down, Khan eats a leg kick, catches the foot. Oh, lovely left hook from Khan. Taylor again just doing a good job walking his man to the cage. Bit more power in that one. And a bit more sting to it. Khan comes forward. Taylor going to the body with that left body kick is tremendous throughout this first and second round. Nice low kick. Oh, 
Good oh, work from lo Khan. Lovely from Khan. Good jab. Khan is doing a great job. The issue is the shots there just seem to be a little few and far between. And 100% do not stop fighting until the referee tells you. Good work by Khan there. Tried to put in a combination upstairs and downstairs. Bit of a low blow. Slightly low, it wasn't too bad. Now, I'm not going to say that Khan wanted the breather, but he's definitely not going to turn it down right now. <laughs> Only a few seconds left in this round. Taylor again just trying to plant that knee. Good work there by Khan again with a jab. That's the second time that Khan has got through with that left jab. Khan skips on the outside. Sound of the bell. There's two fighters in there and one of them seems to be really feeling the pace of this fight. The, the, the weight of the occasion, and one fighter seems to be cool, calm, collected, not breathing heavy. Taylor seems to have all the energy in the world, so we'll see how this translates going into the third round. Lovely, that lovely combination by Khan you see in the replay. Great defense from Taylor as well, though. Khan is throwing big combinations to the head, going down to the body, but Taylor seems to be cool, calm, collected, picking his shots well. Great job. Lovely straight, straight shots from Taylor. Flash of legs, sees Khan land on the canvas. But Taylor quite the showman. You're hearing from Taylor's corner, Ken, Kenny Moyston that is screaming out, let your hands go, let your hands go to George Taylor. And I think absolutely. Oh, but he got caught with a big right hand from Khan. And again, Khan just trying to work around the outside. Good work right again. left hook. So Khan is getting through with some shots, but I feel like the difficulty he is having is staying on that back foot, staying with his back against the cage. Taylor with a good high kick. Pushing the pace again, making Khan come forward. Khan is, look, Khan is looking like he's really feeling the pace of this fight. And I feel like he's going to have difficulty closing the distance on the back foot with his back towards the cage. Again on that jab. And again, trying to push the pace. So Taylor's doing a great job getting into position, but when he gets into position, he isn't letting his hands go. He's walking forward, seeing the shots, but not letting them go. 
and he needs to be very, very careful because Khan is getting through with, with little ones, little two, little combinations, and Taylor may end up losing some of these rounds and may end up losing the fight. You never know what the judges are seeing. Yeah, for me, I've got to be honest, looking at that fight, it was quite decisively a Taylor victory. I think Taylor controlled a lot of the action, used his range well. Credit to Khan for picking him off with that jab every now and again and catching him with a hook. But for me, the busier fighter club quite clearly was Taylor. And, and, and Rob, by, by the sounds of the crowd, I think they agree with you. fighters to the center of the cage please once again we consult the judges scorecards ladies and gents I can tell you it is a unanimous decision to the red corner George Taylor